to not only endorse and spend the next day or two out knocking on doors, talking to people, calling them up, because we are going to elect Melissa Conyers Irvin to be the city treasurer. All right. And the first person I'd really like to bring up knows what it means to be a treasurer. All right. Yes. <laughs> she has been the county treasurer for 21 years. And so she's counted a lot of money. <laughs> we used to sit next to each other when we were both on the county board, and we had a lot of fun. She's an attorney, she's a doctor, and she's a great county treasurer. All right. All right. All right. Delighted to be here today. I love Melissa. I think it would be great to have Melissa in City Hall and Maria on the county side. Right. This is a new thing, okay? This is what this government needs is Melissa and Maria. That's so right. let me just tell you a little bit about why I think it is so important that Melissa be elected to this position. I do a lot of work around the tax sale, and every year I call upon elected officials to help me find seniors and homeowners who either need their exemptions or need to be taken off the tax sale list. And we have reduced that number greatly. But in my business, on the county side, you can't get it done unless other elected officials rise to the occasion. And I can tell you that Melissa has been instrumental in helping me reduce the number of homes that are being sold countywide. You know, you can have all the credentials in the world, and I can have a PhD, and she can have an MBA. But in this business, on top of being really smart, people have to like you. And I have been through many an election, and she happens to come to the same grocery store when I'm handing out bags. <laughs> and it's a parade of people in line to see Melissa because they like her. And the reason that they like her is because she connects. And you need a city treasurer that absolutely connects to the people of the city of Chicago. So here's the new byline. Melissa and Maria. How do you need that? More than more than Maria to endorse Melissa Conyers Irvin for the next city treasurer of the city of Chicago. All right. from the west side to the south side, those of us who live on the south side, we're not going to forget you. You will carry the first congressional district uh, in this upcoming election. And we just got to remember now, we can't take, it, we can't take this for granted. That's right. You know, we got to get out and we got to vote. That's right. Standing uh, in, the, in front of the media, behind the podium, that's one thing. You know, Getting out and voting is something all together different. Yes, and I want you to know I voted yesterday. Thank you. So you can go over and check it out on 95th and August. <laughs> <laughs> I cast my vote for Melissa Collins early for the next city treasurer. Woo! Thank you. 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 This lady who we all love, respect, this lady who is, was born to leave right. our next treasure yes. of the great city yes. of Chicago, Melissa Conyers Irving. Yes.
Wow. Wow. I don't know why Congressman Rush um, has any anxiety to follow Congressman Davis. <laughs> well, I tell you, we are well represented in Congress. I tell you, on the south and west sides of Chicago. Okay. So I certainly like to give homage to our Congressman Davis and Bobby Rush. Let's give them a hand. All right. and making certain they fight for us in Washington, D.C. And we know what's sitting in the White House at Washington, D.C. So it's important that we have these two gentlemen that go to Washington for us and fight for us every day. So we thank you so much for your work and your leadership. Now, what can I say about this mighty woman to my left? <laughs> woman to my left who's not afraid yeah. not afraid that's what I like about her yes. because those that know me know that I'm certainly not afraid right. as well right. and when you have her as the county treasurer yeah. and Melissa as the city treasurer yeah. look out City Hall yeah. Yeah. to go to City Hall and fight for working families and continue for the work that has already been done. So thank you so much, Cook County Treasurer Maria Pappas. And that means a lot because she knows what it takes to be a treasurer. And she sees me as her partner on the city level to work with her and I look forward to doing so. So guess what? Tuesday is just a few days away. And I know that in Chicago, one of our biggest issues facing families is the growing gap between the haves and the have-nots. Yes. That's why I was so proud on just last week to support the increase in Illinois minimum wage yes. as state representative. Yes. I have been a voice for working families and will continue to be that voice on a citywide level. I do come from a household of a single mother of three girls, a humble beginning. And I wear that badge with honor. And that's why I will always be a champion for working families in Chicago and in Illinois. With election day just a few days away, we are continuing to push ahead towards victory. Working harder every day and meeting people all over Chicago all while never forgetting that I will be the voice for all residents of Chicago, while increasing transparency and being a watchdog of taxpayers' money, mm -hmm. all right. being the only candidate with an MBA in finance, and over a decade of experience in the private sector, born and raised in Chicago, someone that has walked in the shoes of our working families, Someone that would make the treasurer's office to serve our values and serve every community in Chicago. I ask that you will send me, Melissa Conyers Irvin, to be the next city treasurer of Chicago. All right. Please make certain that you punch 50. We in Chicago know what 5 -oh means. I ask that you punch 50 and make certain that you tell everyone that you are supporting Melissa Conyers Irvin. Thank you. All right. All right.